Hey guys, thanks for joining us on this little project. We are going to clean the mass airflow sensor on this 2015 Chevrolet Tahoe. It's got a 5.3 with a six speed automatic transmission. That's the 6L80. Anytime that you change the fluid or do any work to a 6L80 or the 8L90 or the 10 speed, you should really clean this mass airflow sensor, even if you're just changing the fluid. The mass airflow sensor can cause a lot of harsh downshifts. It can cause some erratic upshifts you will want to change or clean that mass airflow sensor to make that operation better for that transmission. People don't realize that when we did away with modulator valves and those kinds of things, how much the transmission depends on the information it gets off of your throttle position sensor, your speed sensor, your mass airflow sensor. That information is needed to help this transmission shift the way it's supposed to. I'm gonna turn on the under hood light. There's your mass airflow sensor. Okay, so if you're going to clean this mass airflow sensor, let me talk to you about a few things. One thing is only use mass airflow sensor cleaner. Don't try to use a carb cleaner or anything like that. It'll leave a residue on it. You don't want that. Use mass airflow sensor cleaner. First, you'll just pull this tab up, this red tab. Like that. Right inside of it is a black tab, right in the center there. Push it in and unhook your mass airflow sensor. You'll have two torques, one here, one here. Okay, and then you just slide your sensor up out of there. Okay, so let's go to the bench and get it clean. Okay, so what you're gonna do is you're just gonna spray this whole thing down, clean anything off of it you can. <coughs> I like to let it dry for just a second. You can see it drying off of it. Then I go back over it one more time. Okay, so I'm gonna let it dry for a few minutes, and then we're gonna put it back in there. When I'm tightening these up, I use a screwdriver style. I don't know what the torque specs is on these, so I just switch over to the screwdriver style, and that way I know I can put it down on there tight without breaking anything, so. You may be able to look up those torque specs on this. I have no clue, but I've looked and looked. I couldn't find any torque specs. Plug it back in, push your red tab down, and you should be good to go on cleaning your mass airflow sensor on a 2015 Chevy Tahoe 5.3.